Anybody know what a palindrome is? What's a palindrome? Blue shirt. Um, it's a word that's the same yeah, it's a word that's spelled the same forwards and backwards. So we're going to use the letters in the word race car. Uh. We're going to use the letters in the word race car to stand for seven crucial concepts that every good point guard needs to understand. And I think it's appropriate that this is a palindrome because by the time you leave here on Thursday, I want you to know these seven things backwards and forwards. So the R and the A in race car go together. A good point guard will always race the ball from arc to arc. They race the ball from arc to arc. By arc to arc, I mean three-point line to three-point line. Good point guard makes it a habit to always race the ball from arc to arc. There aren't a lot of good things that can happen to you in basketball in between the arcs. Most of the good stuff in basketball happens inside the arcs. And a good point guard makes it a habit to get the ball inside the arc as quickly as possible. And there's two ways. You can race the ball up the court. You can race the ball with a dribble, or you can race the ball with a pass up ahead to a teammate who's already inside the arc. You can't look special if your habit is to walk the ball up the court. You can't look special if your habit is to walk the ball up the court. And we're going to be talking a lot this week about habits. Basketball is a game of habits. Life is a game of habits. And most point guards will base their game on hope, or they base their game on luck. In other words, they hope they get lucky and make a good play. They hope they get lucky and score a bucket. They hope they get lucky and make a nice pass to a teammate who can score a bucket. Most point guards base their game on hope. But good point guards will base their game on habits. Habits that are going to work against the best competition that they're ever going to face. And you can't look special if your habit is to walk the ball up the court. A good point guard makes it a habit to get the ball inside the arc quickly, either with a pass or with a dribble. A good point guard makes it a habit to bring the ball up the court at a speed that makes the defense uncomfortable. They make it a habit to bring the ball up the court at a speed that makes the defense uncomfortable. A good point guard makes it a habit to take advantage of a disorganized defense. In fact, that's the reason that you race, is to take advantage of a disorganized defense. Anytime a team goes from being on offense to then having to get back and be on defense, there's a moment in time when they're disorganized. A good point guard makes it a habit to take advantage of that disorganization. And don't misunderstand, though, what I'm saying. Race does not mean rush. Race does not mean rush. That's not the same thing. There's a difference between racing the ball from arc to arc and just doing something fast or doing something in a hurry. It's not about getting a quick shot. Racing is not about getting a quick shot. It's about getting a good shot. It's about probing that disorganized defense to see if you, you can get yourself or a teammate an easy shot, a high percentage shot. That's the reason that you race. You don't race just to do something fast or to force something. You race to probe that disorganized defense, to bring the ball up the court at a speed that makes that disorganized defense uncomfortable, to see if you can find yourself or a teammate an easy shot.